Ole Gunnar Solskjaer privately unhappy Manchester United failed to sign new midfielder last summer. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer is privately unhappy that Manchester United failed to sign new midfielder last summer, according to reports. The Red Devils were linked with summer moves for Declan Rice, Eduardo Camavinga, Leon Goretzka and Aurelian Chaumeni, but ultimately prioritised deals for club legend Cristiano Ronaldo England star Jadon Sancho and World Cup winner Rafael Varane. Solskjaer has already used seven different midfield combinations this season, and United's vulnerability in the centre of the pitch was once again exposed on Saturday as Leicester City sealed a 4-2 win to pile more pressure on the Norwegian boss. The defeat at the King Power Stadium saw Manchester United's winless run in the league extend to three matches, with Solskjaer's side slipping to sixth in the top flight, five points behind leaders Chelsea. Solskjaer has repeatedly insisted he is happy with his squad at Old Trafford and believes the current group can lead the club to silverware, but the men say he is privately unhappy that the new midfielder did not arrive through the doors over the summer. Manchester United have spent more than £450 million on transfer signings since Solskjaer replaced Jose Mourinho as manager in December 2018, but current midfielders Fred, Scott McTominay, Nemanja Matic and Donny van de Beek have been criticised by fans. Former England striker and Premier League legend Alan Shearer believes Man United made a mistake by failing to sign a central midfielder during the last window. To view this video please enable JavaScript and consider upgrading to a web browser that supports HTML5 video that was Manchester United's problem last season, they didn't invest in that position, and it's the same again he said on match of the day, following United's defeat to Leicester. There's no one in there to really press and take control from the front. You can't do that in the Premier League. They will always score, Man United, because of the brilliance they have going forward. But you cannot press if you haven't got that aggression. Despite Solskjaer's struggles at Old Trafford, reports say he is in no immediate danger of being sacked, with Manchester United still backing the former star to turn things around. Following the Leicester defeat, Solskjaer said. The whole performance was not good enough with or without the ball. Over the international break we have had a good look to see what has gone wrong lately. We have had too many games where we have lost points, so we need to look at the whole setup and balance of the team, and maybe something has to give. Every point in the Premier League you have to fight for. You have to tackle, block and win headers, and in key moments today we didn't do that enough. Every game is a test of character here. Especially now it is an examination of character, staff, players and everyone around here. How remarkable Patrick Vieira is using Arsenal experience to revitalize Crystal Palace Newcastle. Confirm fan is stable and responsive after collapse during Tottenham defeat Tottenham ace Ree Gillen. Reveals what he told referee after fan collapsed in Newcastle crowd for more stories like this.